In a remote location outside Montevideo, a humble president was running out of time. His term was coming to an end, and there was still no marijuana to supply his country. Pepe Mojica sent his best man on the most important secret mission in Uruguay's history. Come on, go. Start it. Travel to the U.S. to bring marijuana back to their country. Do you know what I can get some weed? Marijuana. Oh, holy. An infiltration into America's marijuana industry. What do you do, Alfredo? I am the president of the Uruguayan Chamber of Legal Marijuana. Should I speak to you or to the camera? Me, you're fine. But Alfredo was not alone. His mother has his back. I come from the first country in the world that legalized marijuana. A huge hoax from a tiny country. I want to uh, welcome President Mujica to the Oval Office in the White House. We need 50 tons of marijuana a year. That's a lot. But things get complicated. Trade in marijuana from the United States is, is always illegal. And take an unusual turn. We are offering you not a neighborhood, not a city, but a country. For an unusual president. Salud, Presidente, por el Uruguay, por el futuro. The leader of the free world is tricked by the poorest president on earth. Is he Alemán? Coten, Coten, front entrance, Coten. Yo me voy a seguir ese año en un calabozo. My pharmacy was the first one to give marijuana to users. We started with brownies, are very famous in Uruguay. I'm here in country. 